Good morning guys, what's up? How are you? Today is crazy. Um, we have a showing, so we are in one hour. It's 10 o'clock right now. We need to be out of the house by around 11 because they will probably get here around 11.15, so I'm out of breath, running around, straightening the house, trying to get it ready. Um, there's a lot of activity. Um, on this house, we have had multiple showings. We have several more. Um, hopefully you saw yesterday's video or the day before about the offer that came in. Watch that video if you haven't. So, um, and we might be getting a cash offer potentially soon. So I don't know, there's just, it's a lot. Um, things are just working out and we're hopeful and, and happy about the whole house situation. Um, I'll update you in this video on, on Daniel and I and things like that. So stay tuned for that. I gotta get this house in order. Please subscribe if you haven't. We'd love for you to be a part of our family and a part of our journey. We have a lot going on. We are sharing some real vulnerable aspects of our life right now. Um, so anyways, stick around. Okay, kind of funny thing, it's a hot mess. Um, Seb poured a whole lot of food in the bowl for the kitties last night. So they eat their food in our bathtub. And this is the last thing that I do when I um, am cleaning up. We have forgotten it before. And I remember how horrified Daniel and I were that um, we left this out and I'm like, oh my gosh, we're gonna come to the tub and see this is where our cats eat. So I always have to remember to remove this so they don't see where our cats eat. And I just told the internet world, so there you go. <sighs> Hello, my friends, how are you guys? Miss Capri Page, and we're gonna head to Target and do some Target shopping. What is it that you need, Miss Girl? Shampoo, Shampoo. conditioner, sure. um, skincare okay. stuff, uh -huh. um, shaving cream, okay, and toothpaste. Toothpaste. Actually, I need toothpaste too, so we'll both get some. Okay, and we'll just see what else. What else is out? We'll check out anything new, clothes-wise, like all the things. Um, I would imagine since Christmas is over, New Year's is over, I guarantee you it's all Valentine's stuff. Wait, when is that? February 14th. Okay, let's go. Okay, so we're getting good stuff. This I cannot live without, so. When I run out, I'll come out and get more. Okay, so, but we'll do a full haul on everything we get, so stay tuned. But you guys, they are adding a whole section of Curology. You used to have to like go online and get like a subscription nice and go mermaid. through. What? Nice mermaid. Nice mermaid. You probably had one of those at one point. And go through like a, like a dermatologist to get the products. And so I'm excited to see what Curology products they get. So go check your Target out if you have them. Okay, we're gonna keep going. Capri, you look so cute. Do you know what this makes me think of? Or two things. When we did the... I know, you always say that. Mannequin challenge. <sighs> Mannequin challenge. Every time. Every single time. Okay, thank you. It's, I think it's starting to end now. Oh, okay, okay, thanks, Kat. Um, okay, on another note, I need, a, I need, okay, so this is what I normally take to cheer comps, but it is just, let me just tell you guys, it's not cutting it. I need a book bag and I want one. Now, in a perfect world, if I were like, Money without an issue. I get a I cute Louis, like, huh? I don't think this would match. Really, I'm not. So just get like black. But I kind of, I just feel like this one's cute. In a perfect world, I'd get a Louis or something like. But it's not a perfect world over here, is it? So I need something I just, that I. This is too small because let me. I' gonna have the camera, my phone. I have like all, all kinds of things. Everybody comes to me for like bobby pins, Motrin. Feminine products, all the things. And I want to always be able to have that because I feel like everybody knows just to come to me. Find Kindle, she's got all that. So I need something bigger and just something that can be on my back really easily. And I'm, and the camera doesn't fit so well in here. Um, I see this one. I don't, I just, that's so basic. I mean, it's kind of, I mean like, it's, it's like basic. definitely not like the cutest. It is not. So can, can we maybe, we are going to the, we're going to the mall. We are? Um, no, Friday. we're not. Well, By the way, I want to tell you guys, Bryn has a f like over three thousand or four dollars in her bank account that she's been saving, and now she's finally ready. You guys know what she was saving for. We have an update on that. She's no longer saving for that, um, but 
she's gonna, she's ready to spend her money that she's worked hard for. It's all like her YouTube money. Um, so I think we're gonna go to the mall and maybe I can find, but not today, maybe tomorrow. Maybe I can find a cute bag, but I need a book bag. I can't, this, this, these little Lulu fanny packs aren't cutting it anymore. So, I don't know. Hmm. No, she had to. Mm -hmm. I like your glasses. Your music for you and ah! Okay, so we're done, and we thought we'd do a little haul for you right now. It's all like skincare, health, and beauty stuff. Um, whew, summer is back, and pretty much winter is over. I don't think we had those cold days at Christmas, which were actually really fun, right? I, I love it's fun. A lot and the walks that you guys were going on, you were freezing. Okay. Um, let's go for it. I have a bag, you have a bag. I don't know what's in what. Let's just All go. All right, so start. first is, is it? Cera um, CeraVe. CeraVe? CeraVe. Ooh, CeraVe or C CeraVe. CeraVe? Maybe the way you, probably the way you said it. And this is the, um, wait. It's the um, acne wash cleanser and she really likes it, works really well. Um, it's really good for Kat because like, she is at the gym almost every day. <laughs> Um, tumbling and yeah. doing things and she sweats and stuff. It's also, good to clean your I also skin. have like uh, really sensitive skin too. Yes, that's like, true. Basically everything. Yes. And then pimple patch. And Capri said, you said that these were the best that work for you. Yes. Better than the star ones. Like th these ones like you put it on and then like you wait like like a whole day, day or something and then when you peel off like that like yellow part comes with it. Oh, whoa, okay. That's intense. And then these are Capri's favorite shampoos. And you add, you have a little booster to add to the shampoo, right? Yeah, I think it's in. Might be in. Oh, it's in mine. And this is the volumized um, booster that you add to the um, shampoo bottle. You put the whole thing in it. And then nail filer and whatever this is. Okay, so to... this one is new. Okay, right here. I'll let you guys see it. It is. Um, the Neutrogena Stubborn Marks PM Treatment works nightly to help with reverse the look of post acne marks and uneven tone. Um, the place that Capri gets um, breakouts is her back and that is really because of, I think, just sweating so much at cheer. Yeah. Um, and so we're working on, on that and this is gonna help the, the scarring. So. And then the candy, she dropped pop. Mm -hmm. yeah. Your fave, is that your favorite? Yeah. It is. Okay. Is that, are you done with your yeah. bag? Okay, so let's go to mine. Um, Cap and I both got toothpaste. Um, she likes charcoal. So she got the Colgate Optic White with charcoal. And then I got the um, Colgate Optic White Pro Series. It has hydrogen peroxide for my coffee tea. <laughs> um, then um, we got, um, Cap and I will share that. We love Tree Hut, um, and so this one it's is the cotton, cotton candy. candy, and it really smells so good. It's sweet and yummy. And then for my snack, don't laugh, I'm waiting for you to call it like a grandma snack. This legit is a grandma it snack. Is a no, grandma this is a grandma snack. snack. It, like, I will give you that. so grandma. You, you're starting to become a grandma. <laughs> well, I'm getting old. Yeah. I am, I'm old. Um, peppermint patties. In the comments, let me know if you like peppermint, pat blah, 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 peppermint patties because I love them. I they are like, actually like Brindley likes stuff. them. Let's okay. You open yours. I'm gonna open mine, and you open yours. I don't like anything. And in these there are teeny, and I want them. I like the bigger ones, but I couldn't find like this the single one. Let's go for it. <gasps> Capri just found out she has extra practice tomorrow for J3. She's she's trying to recover from that news. And our coach said that she's gonna go. They're gonna go hard. Yep. Let's go full out. Full out. Okay. Yay. Here we go. Mm. This is not diet friendly. Actually, it's probably not that bad for one. 50 calories. Well, let's not look at carbs because I actually count carbs, not calories. And the, the carbs are going to be bad. Yeah, bad. Mmm, calorie. So mm. Mm. Oh, it stinks. Mm. Ew. Mm -mm. It's so mm. good. Okay, okay. You win. Mm. I'm sure you win. I'm sure you win. I can't get this open. Mm. Braces. Bye guys. Okay, I have this camera balancing on a Chick-fil-A cup with the straw bent, so it kind of has it angled up. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. Okay, I just wanted to give you guys an update on life for me. Woo! 
and Hampton's literally, literally gonna get home any second now. But life for me, update just on things, how I'm feeling, how Daniel and I are doing. So it's, it's been a process and it's waves. But I feel like within the past like day, um, we're talking like Daniel and I, cause he's, he's staying here. Uh, he lives, he lives at the house, which I've told you guys. Um, and we're able to talk, we're cordial or, or like I'm nice to him <laughs> because there's been so much anger, obviously, as you can understand that I've not even been able to really have conversations with him. Um, just difficult, you know, you don't know how you're going to walk this out till you walk it out. You don't know how you're going to feel till it happens and you don't know, going to know there's no right or wrong way. I mean, I guess there's like a wrong way maybe, but there's just no right or wrong way to walk this out. Um, there's bones. Um, so I'm walking it out the best way that I know how. Also being mindful of my children and just the, the tone of the house is, is better. Am I still hurt? Of course, but for me, the goal is forgiveness. Not, not saying on the other side of that is a completely restored relationship or not but for my own journey and healing I have to I have to work towards forgiveness because really when you live in bitterness and unforgiveness it's the other it doesn't hurt the other person it hurts you and and so I need to be free from that so I'm working towards forgiveness and um, not having bitterness because I can't I can't walk out the rest of my life holding on to that and I don't want to what's going to be on the other side of that i don't know you know i don't know and you know talking to people i've talked to people on both sides i've talked to people that have had this happen and they're and they did get they did split up and and there wasn't reconciliation and i've talked to friends that have gone through exactly what i've gone through and with therapy there was reconciliation and in fact their marriage became better than what it was before so there's two two ways there's two outcomes and both are right and both are okay and you don't know and I, I think initially like when something like this happens of course your first reaction is i hate this person i never want to see him again and as as i did you know you're walk you're watching me walk through this in real time real time as i am living out these feelings day by day ups and downs so um this is where we're at. I'm trying to work towards forgiveness. And of course, forgiving the person doesn't forget what they did or what the experience or what happened or the trauma and all of that. Forgiveness is for me. Um, and, you know, yeah, I, I, this, I, I said before, I, I'm not pursuing divorce because I don't feel like I can make that decision. I, I, I can't. And what if, what if? there is reconciliation on the other side of this what if you know what if what if there isn't but what if there is so time will tell and um i have to be open to both sides i have to be open to what feels right and and what is the right thing to do you know could i tell you i don't know months in a year or whatever that you know we are working towards reconciliation and and part of me think oh thinks that would be amazing if that were to happen i don't i don't know you know it's just such a hard journey again you're watching it in real time so a week from now i could tell you something different tomorrow i could tell you something different i just don't know i don't know um another I, i've been getting excuse me this question is daniel going to come back into the vlogs i'm i'm sure he will he he's still a part of our lives um he's still a part of the kids i mean we're, we're all here we still do you know live life together so yeah eventually i'm sure he's just being very respectful and giving me my space you know naturally and my time and um allowing me to have this space as my own like you guys this space is my own so when you know we feel it's ready for him to be back in the vlogs maybe he'll be back in the vlogs you'll maybe see him in the background sometimes because he he's not here right now he's at a meeting but he, he is still here and we have a competition next weekend which he is going so um i'm sure you'll see him in the vlogs then because he's definitely still a part of that 
whole experience of cheer. So I don't, I don't know. I, I one day at a time still, but working towards just working towards through my feelings, so to speak, and coming to a place where we aren't, where I'm literally not yelling and tearing him apart with my words because that's what I've been doing, and just being peaceful and kind and that's. Anyways, that's where I'm at. Hampton's home, and so I want to hear how his... And we have a showing, like, in a couple hours, so I've got to make sure the house is perfect. And Brindley has a private with Tara, so all of us are going <laughs> to that because we have to be out of the house. So I'm going to go. Um, again, I'm not ending the vlog, so I'll see you in a little bit. Okay, Bones, did you have a good day? Yeah. Did you have a good day at school? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. How was your teacher? Two. A yeah. what? Two, and two. did you take Foxy? Yeah. Did you show your teacher? Yeah. Did she like Foxy? Yeah. 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 Did you show any of your friends, Foxy? Yeah, I showed Lucy. Oh, did you show Isabella? Yeah. Did she like it? Yeah. Good. Yeah. You have fun. Did you uh, eat breakfast and watch PJ Masks? No. What did you watch? A uh, baby doll. What's that? A baby show? I don't know. You don't know what it's called? Yeah. Did you like it? No. Oh. Yeah, I don't. Oh, okay. Sorry about that. Yeah. Okay. But you had a good day? Yeah. Okay, good. Glad you're home. Yeah. Okay, Brittany just got a package from Amazon. and she, Oh, I didn't realize you didn't have any on yours. Mm -mm. Um, so she got gibbets. These and these are so in. cute. These are really hard to put in. Is it the same one, the same brand that you got for? I don't think so. For ham? I don't think so. Oh, but she got Lucky Charms. Oh, wait, this is actually Crocs. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They aren't like the off-brand ones. Because the other ones that um, we have are like the not Crocs. What the heck is that? That's the unicorn one. What? That's the unicorn one. Why does that not look like unicorn? That's oh, now I see it. Because it's like marshmallow. Yeah. Cute. <gasps> I love the rainbow one. I'm put okay, right this literally looks like the more you know. You don't know what that is. That's an yeah. 80s thing. That's yeah. funny. Lucky turns. Those are cute. Struggling to get it in. The struggle. The struggle. They are hard because that thing is gigantic. I think you have to angle it. And then kind of push it in. I know that's what I've been doing. Okay. We will trust that you'll get it in. Good job. All right, Brittany Lou. So, Bryn and I are kind of becoming obsessed with these free people. Tanks are really cute. So, I have like the gray color. I think it's just gray. I mean, it's kind of like black gray. Mm -hmm. But Bryn ordered the prettiest color. It's a periwinkle. And it's I want so the blue pretty. one though. I want that one. Uh, we're gonna go to the mall tomorrow and I'm gonna see if Nordstrom has, you had to order, Friday. Friday. You had to order that one. Mm -hmm. I got mine in store at Nordstrom. And I feel like the fun colors you have to order, but I'm out of breath. I was just doing lunches, I know. I'm so out of breath, but um, I really like it. It's so pretty. You gonna wear it tomorrow? Mm -hmm. Yeah, what are you gonna wear it with? What should I wear it with? Gosh, you could wear it with anything. I mean, I think that's the thing. It's so versatile. Leggings. You could wear it with leggings. You could wear it with jean shorts. Mm hmm Jeans. Yeah. Lots of different things. I need to get some jeans. I don't have them. You should get some flare jeans. I have flare jeans, actually. forgot about that. You do? Mm -hmm. Where'd you get those from? Hollister. I forgot about those. I got them a long time ago. Oh, I yeah. I feel like you haven't worn them. You could wear them with that. They'd be cute. Wouldn't be cute. I mean, you could try. Oh. Let me go. I have a phone call. Hey, okay, there's Bryn's finished Crocs. Super cute. I love it. I'm going to get another one and I'm going to put it like right You're here. You're not going to put the, you didn't put the Lucky Charm. Mm -mm. Actually, Charm. All right, I love them. Super cute. Like, for some reason, the unicorn bothers me because it's hard to tell <laughs> it's a unicorn. <gasps> there. Okay. Perfect. Love it. <laughs> All right, guys. I am going to close out the vlog. Uh, today was a great day. It was really good. Do you have a good day, Cap? Um, yeah, there's just a lot going on. I mean, obviously there's a lot going on, but there's also a lot of other things going on that I really can't share right now, but I will. And it's actually all really good. Um, it's really crazy how God works things out in ways that you never thought he would and how things are just like, it's, I, I, I can't wait for to share just a lot. It's a lot and it's all really good and yeah so it was a good day Bryn did you have a good day mm -hmm. oh Bryn had a great private today by the way mm -hmm. she's got her aerial and it looks really good today was the best you've thrown her aerial mm -hmm. it was so high 
and beautiful. Yeah. She also is working her standing tuck, and you did really good on your standing tuck today. Did and it on? It was the first time it, I did on, it on the floor. I know. I'll insert a clip of her doing it on the floor, and of course, I'll put in her aerial too because they her aerial is beautiful. Um, she also is working her punch front. She's doing really good on that. And Michael was like, um, Cap. Michael was like, Brindley, you've got this. It's in your blood. Your whole, like, you come from a family of people who have really good punch fronts. Because Cap and Seb both have great, naturally, it came natural to them to do punch fronts. And um, Brynn's going to be the same because she's really, um, she's throwing it all by herself. Like, Tara doesn't even stand there. And it, when she gets on the floor, it's going to. That's next. Tara said next next practice she's gonna put you on the floor for the punch front. Mm. So she had a great private. <clears throat> um, she is tumbling in her routine. We're cut. We've come far. They know about. They know. Um, but that's exciting. So um, it's gonna be. It's just. A, it's just been a great season for all the kids um, so far. But um, we have a very busy weekend, and tomorrow we are going to. Um, the mall, a different mall, and Brynn is gonna spend her money and she promised she was gonna buy me something. Whoa. She has more money than me, so I'm very excited. I'm gonna go to the Gucci store. We're going to the Boca Mall, so we're gonna go to the Gucci store. I'm gonna pick something out, so there you go. All right, guys, I love you so much. I love you, love you, love you, and um, I will see you tomorrow. Bye.